Hey, eraser, eraser! Should have been looking where you were going. Where were you even storing that? It seriously looks like he just pulled it out of nowhere. Look what I just found. It's a rectangle. Also, did Pen fail elementary school or what? Really? I didn't think it was that scary. How? How are they so scary? It's literally just a shape. Use of a bystander as a tool without consent. Now it is a quadrilateral and a triangle. Did you hear that? He almost called it a triangle. Turns out Pen isn't the only dumb one here. Where? Hold on, TB. I'm busy looking for Leafy. But golf ball. Shush, I have to concentrate. Wait, there's Leafy right now. Golf ball too? But for a completely different reason? All she had to do to find Leafy was turn 90 degrees to her left. Seeds don't just stop in midair like that. Hey, have any of you seen my blueberry seeds? Blueberry seeds. Despite the fact that they are clearly pink. I have no words. Also, those are massive blueberries. Where did Pin find those seeds? The Yoel City nuclear plant? Fiery can sweat despite being fire. Why would you do this to her yellow face? I know that this is a type of fractal nowadays, but when I first saw this, I thought it was a Triforce. Made of smaller Triforces made of forks. Plus one for confusing me. Yeah! Bell does a mischief and destroys all of Gelatin and Puffball's hard work. Also those magical forks hanging there by Gelatin's arm. I know they removed it in the compilation version, but still. Wow, Bubble, it's so cool that you get your very own recovery center. Is this implying that everyone else doesn't get their own recovery centers? Because it gets contradicted later when we see Pi have her own recovery center. Speaking of her, why is Cake blushing at her here? Does he have an unrequited crush on her or something? And he's being a coward by not confessing. Unbelievable. Pencil immediately assumes Nelly popped Bubble, despite the fact that she wasn't even near them when she got popped. And she doesn't even have any forks. And she literally said she didn't pop Bubble. <laughs> Loser sounds like he's dying when he says this. Also, it goes completely unexplained why everyone loves Loser so much. Tree, Oops. we gotta get Teardrop to talk. Episode title drop. I want to know what's going on inside her head. Loser. This moment, right here, had a negative effect on discussion around Teardrop, because now everyone likes to make videos about how, ooh, this is what she sounds like, this is her real voice. Like, no, stop, can't we just let her be mute? Lai tries to pressure Tree into helping her even though he'd already said no twice. Also, this is kinda nasty when you think about it. Ice Cube is putting her legs in Teardrop's throat. Even worse is that Bracelet encourages it. Because self-improvement only occurs when we acknowledge that our own behaviors are far from perfect and, dare I say, worthy of hate. Fanny's complaints are completely irrelevant to the situation at hand. And after Ice Cube stops and decides she wants to stop, Lai pressures her into continuing. Yeah, I see! Let's hear you cheer! Oh, f*** off, Bracelet-y. Teardrop, how could you chomp so viciously on poor innocent Ice Cube? You should feel ashamed. No, Clock. You should feel ashamed for blaming her for involuntarily chomping because of the fork that stabbed her. Well, I think we both wronged Teardrop today. You don't get to say that lie. You wronged her. Clock didn't do anything nearly on the same level as you. God, I hate this scene. Hey guys, can I be part of the truce? Minecraft sounds. Well then, you little rascal are a mere follower, and followers never win! Man, he did not need to go off like that on her. Oh, why doesn't Katie like me? Leafy, she never said that. Don't put words in people's mouths. Well, you clearly aren't egging me on. Egg pun. I thought you'd be curious, but I guess not. Also, she very clearly is. I've done some research, and I believe it means that the person cares so little that the last droplets of care spirit are being sucked out of their body, through their arms, and out of the tips of their fingers, and into the outer reaches of interstellar space to be lost forever. Pseudoscience. A true indicator that person doesn't give a fluff. That sounded very edited, as in they cut out the VA saying the F word and replaced it with fluff. Now wait, Lolly, let's think about this. If Barfbag's brain is being infected with puke, that's not her fault, so don't be mean about it. More pseudoscience. What is this, an anti-vax Facebook group? What's next, are they gonna extol the values of essential oils? Flower's pretty beautiful. <gasps> I'm sure that random out of nowhere interaction won't come back in any way in the future. Go f kill Spongy because, uh, he's fat. With treatment like this, it's no wonder he did what he did later on in the season. Hey, Margaret and Stavely, 
Wanna be friends? Yeah. Whatever. And now Marker gets to be directly responsible for lightning attacking Flower. I totally deserve this treasure. Why? You barely existed this episode up to this point. Black hole, you're strong. Open this jar for me. Mmm, I don't know. That sounds like a bad idea for me to do that. If if you don't help me open it, I'll I'll crush you! You're really playing with fire or antimatter there, flower. This scene still looks amazing six plus years later. Apple sucks! Oh cool, I've been crushed down to a smaller size. How? You literally said yourself that you're infinitely small since you're a singularity just a minute ago. What's this? I don't know, try squishing it. Why would your first instinct when some alien thing arrives be to squish it? Please, I gotta bring her back! Come on, Coiny, show some respect. Pillow, you're the one not showing respect here with your freaking pseudoscience. I hate to live in a world where recovery is impossible, where we die forever. Are you sure? It's possible that there are other recovery centers out there. I mean, we literally see that you can easily just buy a new one later on. Again with the squishing! Finally, Pillow does some good for once. Sigh. I guess we'll never get Pin or Pillow back. How cruel is that? She forgot Balloony. At least Four didn't. A BFDI. Of course we know now that it was a compilation of the first two seasons, but that's still such a strange prize. Also a Spongebob cameo. Morph tween. Wanna be on the same team cause we're both balls? Laugh now. Hey boy! How many people have you killed? That would sound super bad out of context. It sounds bad even in context. Well, Pi, you seriously haven't killed anyone else, like, ever? No, have you? Yeah, I have, but it felt extremely disturbing. You say that as if that's not normal. Did someone say killing? <sighs> How can you prove yourself if you're truly infected? I'm sorry, but just based on your appearance, I gotta say no. Judging a book by its cover, which is ironic since she ends up on a team with Book the Contestant. Robotty, I'll help you! I knew you joined! Apparently, Robotty is speaking in Morse code and is saying don't. So Leafy either doesn't know Morse code and assumes he's agreeing, or she does and is ignoring him. Neither is an all that great possibility. It's a good thing the team is already full, because Icy clearly isn't comfortable with Brace Lady idolizing her. Is that a calculator or Windows 10 live tiles? Also, that clip TV plays when GB selects him is such an odd choice. We need to find a team with three slots open, or else we're gonna get split up. We have to stick together. <laughs> free food, people! Ooh, gimme, gimme, gimme! Ah, the old say one thing, then the opposite happens trope. A classic. <laughs> now that's the team for me. Wow, twice within a minute? What in the MCU writing is this? Two incompatible halves of a team, held together by one person. What could go wrong? Uh, let's not pick David. He's human and that's just weird. Racism. Fun with acronyms. There it is, the team name that is responsible for like 60% of all object show teams since 2017, being named by accident. And I sure am one to talk because I've done this too, so I'm a part of the problem. More Marvel writing. Another accidental name. Okay, I think this name's actually kind of funny because it makes it sound like they're gonna lose all the time. So, I'll allow it. This along with Death Pact are probably the best names this season. The sin is that half of the names kind of suck. And who are you? Tommy. And somehow, they're all able to pronounce it without any issues. All in all, the team forming and naming goes on for way too long, over six minutes. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yep, they're all set to go. Oh, stop it. Uh-oh! Look! X is about to lose grip of his beloved baskets! Oh no! X sounded totally unenthusiastic saying that. Also, what were they thinking trying to hold so many baskets at once? So to clarify, that's the first contest of the battle for BFDI? Title drop, this time of the season. You're alive! I thought you were just an overgrown section of the lawn that the gardener forgot to mow! How could she not tell Grassy wasn't just a part of the grass? He's a completely different shade of green! I'm managing the team! Me too! Go Blocky! Stand up to the managerial class! <gasps> I got it! Oh please, Pen couldn't possibly have blown that hard to make a basket like half a mile away move to X. 
High five! Whoa! So apparently this means their limbs lack bones. So how do they stay standing? Tell her to grin and bear it, and take inspiration from Teardrop. Again with the drawing attention to Teardrop's muteness. What's wrong with the little RPS so we can stress less? We'll guess who's best and bless the rest. Rhyming well challenge. Surely he knew the risks of doing this, even if only knew it was a bad idea. Bubble! You wouldn't want to go against the Alliance's objective, would you? Bamber? Bamber? Manipulation. Loser, I love you! Oh, you're too funny! Why doesn't Fiery care? Pillow, could you stop being a pseudoscientist for five minutes? Don't tell me! Do you not like Loser? Are you ungrateful of his majestic presence? No, I just think we ought to- Remove the hater! Why are you booing me? I'm right! It's too heavy! Are you sure it's heavy, or are you just weak? Because in BFB28, Gelatin, Flower, and Teardrop all have no trouble picking up a basket. Save us, loser! Sure can do. <laughs> and this is the start of a trend with the losers become over-reliant on loser. Here we also see loser inadvertently trap Eggy after he moves the basket. Hey, you spilled the air out of my basket! That's not how gases work. Okay, so tennis ball's gone, but we're still on track to get the basket in minimal possible time. What are you on about? Like, half of the teams are safe already. Surely it was theoretically possible to finish before free food, at least. It's good, but it would be easy if you helped. Okay, just got to the top. So much for difficulty, huh? My reaction matches Blocky's. When would TB have even built the trebuchet? Taco just lets her team die all for a basket. Some team captain, am I right? An extra sin for each death. Let's use Bombi to launch ourselves out! Attempted use of a teammate as a tool without consent. Bubble, are you, like, thinking? Yeah, I'm thinking about Fanny! Well, stop it. Heavy thoughts will, like, weigh you down, and you won't jump as high. Even Match is getting in on the pseudoscience now? Give me a break. Flower, are you? Oh wait, we're enemies. I should not talk to you. Point your teammates! Just set aside your differences. And also, Flower doesn't even want to be enemies. Also, Lightning, buddy, you're a flyer. What are you doing? Where can I get a clock that can launch baskets with its clock hands? Oh, they don't make those? I see. Yay! Come here, precious basket! Wait, what? Did they teleport or something? I think I'm getting close. Hmm. Why the hell is their basket so much smaller than the rest of the baskets? I wouldn't imagine that the lava would shrink the basket, so what gives? No mercy for Ions. Uh, but jumping worked last time. But that's not a very good explanation as to why you thought it would work this time. I want to know what exactly X thought would happen when they tried this.